All right, so my arrow, 422. Um, last time we had um, everybody pulling up. Dude, I I looked at um I looked at the double spread from 421 on like my iPad. Jesus. It looks so good. <laughs> I love this panel so much. This is one of my favorite panels of the series. Absolutely. Without a shadow of a doubt. It's one of my favorite panels in the whole series. I love it. I love that panel so much. So bleach-esque. So bleach. And we know how much Hori loves bleach. Woo! Man. I'm excited. So you had everyone pulling up. All for one. To me, all for one looks sick. Right? He, he looks sick as hell. He looks sick. And I want him to I want to see him do more stuff. Now, the whole Deku with the embers of one for all and all this, I'm wondering where this is leading us. I, I'm I'm wondering. I don't know where where we're going, but I'm I'm along for the ride, Hori. I'm along for the ride, so let's let's spark it up. 422. Breathe. Let's do the damn thing. Alright. Aoyama. Oh no, Aoyama! Run, Midoriya. Shiraku. What happened? What happened? Bro, for a second I thought his head got cut off. It's all like glooping. What's going on? What? Hold on. Is he like a... Is he like in like a, a stasis? Is he not like he's just like catatonic right now? Cause it like it's not misting like it usually is. Is it like just like power like <sighs> Okay. Here we go. Deku's rushing in. That's what I'm saying. He's melt it looks like he's melting, is like glooping. Is that Tendo? That look like Tendo. Is that Tendo? The off one looks crazy. Automatopia, okay. Snipe. Nothing's hitting home. He's too tough. Unlike all unlike all for one, this one totes this one's totes not falling for my rage bait illusions. I I the sentence makes more sense now that I look at who's saying it. I like all for one. This one totes not falling for my rage bait illusions, Kami. Carve a path. One straight to Shigaraki. Dude, look at that cannon thing. Look at that cannon thing. My Omni Factor Unleash is not the result of giving in to base emotion. Rather, this augmentation is me exercising control and authority over my myriad powers. As such, do not presume you have me outnumbered. Ooh. Ooh. That's the girl from, okay, that's a clap from class 2A, really? Okay. Dude, he looks sick as hell. I wanna know what the orbs are, that's what I wanna know. This looks crazy. Whoa, 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 whoa. Is that invisible girl? Oh, she's insane. She's crazy. Oh, she's nuts. I, I wouldn't have did that. I would have jumped on the beam to bend it. I'm glad that she's using her powers like that. I'm glad because everyone, it's like we've been, we've been like trying to like, what could she do with her abilities? And I'm glad that she's, she's being way more creative now than she has been. That's risky. Hagakure. Laser stuff. I'm your gal. That's crazy. Electromagnetic railgun. What are we doing? 
<laughs> Yo, they are. They've been putting Kaminari to work. You ready? Insolent little. Ooh. Leave them alone. Look at everyone jumping in Deku's way to protect them. Everyone jumping in his way to protect them. You're already on your last leg. Save your strength. Because only your strength can sock it to him. So let us tank these hits. Go on. Who's grabbing him? Is Froppy! <laughs> Shoji and Froppy. Oh my, her family's watching. Mommy, Daddy, look. It's this. You see her? Oh no. Do your best, Suyu. Shoji, you can do it. That's that's his friend, right? The rest of us aren't agile enough to weave past these brutal attacks. But we can still carry you partway there. Thanks, Shoji. You too, Suyu. What the? Wow, da ba ba. What's that? Show some guts. Is that Fackum? <laughs> That's not fact. I'm just, no, who is that up there? Because that's Mina right there. Who's that? You got this dude. Get it done. Every The whole world is watching. I will. Oh my gosh. Dude, anytime we get chapters like these, I'd be waiting for all for one to just snatch everything from us. Because he's done it time and time before. Where we'll be, oh, it's working, it's working, it's working. And then he just snatches our body. <clears throat> Man, you can. You can, you can. You are right. This does feel like the opening. This does feel like the opening for this current season. Why? <clears throat> All I see are carcasses soon to be carry on. Why do they refuse to lie down and die? There's a little life to their weary movements, yet their eyes, their eyes have nothing else. I'm waiting for Off One to just go crazy. He finds himself help helplessly watching. Conferring this power to someone so worthless was a mistake. Midoriya, it's your weakness. He's flipping and dipping. Jenna gave him a, a trample, a, a, a trample, a tramp. Trampoline, speak <laughs> to bounce off of. Izuku Midoriya. Weak, feeble strength. Hold on, I need to follow what he's saying. I'm, I need to follow what he's saying. How do they freeze the lay down and die as little life to their weary movement, yet their eyes, their eyes have nothing else. Right. It was something All Might lacked. A support system? All Might didn't have a support system? Is that what we're saying? A feeble strength that spurs these vermin to stand back up so doggedly. That will not perish so long as you keep moving forward. Boy, Ida coming through. Off one shocked. Shocked. I, I thought our ejector seats were disabled, but here we are. <laughs> this is like, these guys are like, we're still alive. Damn, it's, we're still here. 
I take it that was your doing, All Might. Those kids are hoping for absolute victory. So I'd rather keep our losses to a minimum. I didn't know. I, I didn't know if he was bleeding or if it was like cracks. I couldn't tell. I I definitely noticed it though. Because I couldn't tell if it was dripping or if there were like some weird cracks or something. Coming from you, that's rich. Midoriya kid. That day when you dove into the fray, my body took action as well. Yes, ever since that day. Bro! <laughs> that's my boy. <laughs> That's my boy. About to make me cry. Brody's my boy. I, I love movie three. That's, that's my boy. And then you got Melissa there too. Do you recall our first day as we left school? <laughs> Chopper in this moment I understand so clearly what she meant Hang in there Almost at the hospital with Araka You can do it Everyone's doing their best down there But Deku well So this is Uraraka I think we were wondering if it was If, if it might not have been her The screams do your best. Kind of like it. This is the pr the president. The president's going crazy. Then you can't tell me Hori don't be planning this. Send every hero we've got over to Japan pronto. But Mr. President, if all for one wins today, you would be putting our nation's security in jeopardy. Like I give a damn, just do it. I hear them all calling to me. Everyone, everyone screaming. Tsukauchi got the kid. Everyone, everyone. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's getting me emotional. <laughs> getting me actually emotional. You've been my greatest here. Oh. Izuku, this, I'm, hold on. <laughs> oh, this is making me emotional. Hold on. God, God, <laughs> it's making me emotional. I need to look at, hold on, hold on, hold on. I have, hold on, I want to pull something up because if this is what I think it is, then this is one of the greatest callbacks. I got to look at it, hold on. Really quick, let me. Dude, I'm misty eyed like hell. I'm <laughs> That's crazy. Not exactly. I was thinking, I'm like, how he looks in this panel. 
reminded me so much of um when he first activated one for all it's not exactly it's not exactly the same it's not exactly the same but it looked like if you were to look at it from like if you were to change the perspective that Hori drew it it would look damn near the same oh this chapter got me the uh, chapter got me it, the same from chapter three like if you were to change the perspective of when he jumped and did his first attack it would look very similar to when um to this panel this one but there's another deku panel in the series that looks like this thousand percent i just can't find it i know i can't think where it is i'm emotional this chapter Jack me up. I gotta hold on. I gotta breathe. I'm trying to breathe. <laughs> I'm trying to breathe. Izuku Midoriya rising. Okay, so I'm thinking, I don't think this is, unless they hit us with the My Hero's ending in five chapters, ten chapters next week, right? And if they don't hit us with that, um, I think how this goes, because time and time again, with all for one is always the moment of everyone pushing up against all for one and then he pushes back and the pushback is always led to people going down always every single time that all for one's been in a fight in this series it's always the first push and then he pushes back and then we respond with whatever we respond with every single time and sometimes there isn't a response. Like the last time we had one of these like initial push or push back and then we push again. He wiped he wiped everyone and stole quirks and then took off and kept going and and then that's when he ran into Bakugo. But it's like we have this initial push to all for one that we so we could break through. And it's the hope of everyone pushing Deku through. That's what I'm saying. If this, if we don't get hit with the series is ending in five chapters or 10 chapters or something like that, we're not, this isn't the end because how, th how of all this feels, this feels like a, we get hit with the end mad quick. <laughs> Dude, the thought of the series ending is really messing me up right now. But I'm, what, what makes me feel, what makes me feel like something is going to happen is it's the same thing whenever everyone um uh the panel of deku jumping after like i said do your best 324 there's another panel i'm i i would have to find the panel whenever deku first does shoot style if it's similar to that whenever he flies in to save all might uh, that panel's in my brain and i can't i can't think but just how this is going right if this isn't the end I think that I'm just going off of the words of all for one. I'll pull it up in a second. Going off the words of all for one and he's bleeding or whatever. He's put, pu he's pushing the body too far. We, we said like, we don't know wh what state the body is in, or this could be Shigaraki fighting back. We don't know, but, um, using his words, and thinking of like the past with all for one like we had that moment when gigantomachia mount lady and um and um tokoyami and everyone pulled up on all for one and they were getting the upper hand and then he he wiped he blew them all back so i i wouldn't be surprised and just going off of his words when he's like like you have something that all might didn't have one all Might, to our knowledge, 
he doesn't he didn't have the support system all might did a lot of this stuff on his own and he kept everyone at like he, he never let anyone get really too close so it's like he had night eye but him and night eye never were really like buddy buddy like that like night eye was a sidekick but if night eye pushed too much he pushed back a little bit that's what it felt like how their relationship was and more so after the fact of the fight against all for one more so with that especially whenever night i saw whatever he like all Might's future but um deku has a support system and he has people that might that quite literally everyone's fighting would kill themselves or allow themselves to be killed so that deku can win so whenever he's like their their will to keep pushing forward is because of you and if i can stop you they will all fold it's like in war times where if you kill the general or you kill the leader of these men if there's no one to fill that void they don't know what to do and you swiftly can end the battle so with him like he's he's like you keep them moving forward and we never cut back to all all for one we never cut back to all from we switch over and we start getting the we get a little monologue from deku and we see everyone else deku's secret quirk is motivated it is but um we never it's like he he's like he's noticing this and then he has like the shocked moment whenever the, his hand starts messing up so we don't know where that is leading but if the series is an ender i think deku rushes in here for this punch something happens and i don't even know do i want i'm not saying deku goes down for the count but there has to be a i'm thinking there has to be some sort of scramble i'm thinking there has to be some sort of scramble i'm only thinking of this because i don't want him to end the series corkless i said i was fine before with it i'm not fine I'm I'm not fine. <laughs> I've been act, it, like the fact that it's actually happened, and it's sitting with me. I don't want that to be the case, right? I don't. I I said, and you got you remember. I said I was fine with that before. I'm not fine with it. I've been thinking about it. I'm not fine with it. I'm not. It's it breaks my heart. That panel from the last chapter when he's like, I have the embers, and I'm gonna use the embers like how All Might did. I don't want. I know, like the like the end of movie two. I don't. I the end of movie two going through the process of Deku actually losing the quirk, like the thought process, I don't want to go through that again. That was traumatizing for me. So I don't want to go through that and it actually be the real deal. Nah, I'm good. No. Let him keep something. Let him get something. So I'm thinking, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be opposed to everyone like pushing Deku for like this. You could do it. This final blow. And... And it not it isn't the final blow, and Deku is knocked out or whatever, or out of steam or something. And and then there's a scramble, and all for one, or whatever is like making his way through them. And then something with one for all or something happens. So I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Chapter got me emotional. Does it feel like this feels like the end of the series? <laughs> if there's a chapter that feels like the end of the series, this chapter, like this, this makes me feel like this is the end for real, for real. Makes me feel like it. Where? Thing here. The ah. Uh, maybe I don't know. I'm not sure. I don't know what what um. I don't know what this what this says. This like I don't know what this says. Like what is this? 
could it just be like the noise or creaking from from the cork or the the tentacles the whatever the hell all for one's got going on could it just be that i don't know i am shooketh though this chapter really makes me feel like it's the end Tells it screaming. Okay. That is true. The, this is over the hand. But um, I think of everything in this whole chapter, the craziest thing to me is... Is invisible girl jumping in front of this big laser beam and bending it? She's a mad lad. I'm gonna talk talk about someone affected by the Deku gene. <laughs> if you want to talk about someone like affected by the Deku gene, is her? That's crazy to me. Just absolutely insane. One thing that's made that made me think was like made me think about some stuff was especially with the chapter we got um especially with the chapter chapter episode that we got the star episode and just like getting it reinforced whenever All Might was saying whenever um whenever All Might not All Might All for One was saying how he didn't want one for all and new order to collude because that would be like a worst case scenario for him. And then if you go back and think to whenever Deku and Shigaraki were fighting and they were making like the disc like they started to make the discovery that they could break through Tenko and the individual that pointed him in the right direction was Star. And it's just like even in death, long after he made the statement, like his statement did ring true. And because all for one said he was like I should like I should have died too but I was he was so angry like his malice and hatred and his l sense of loss for Yoichi was so great that it kept him alive it's the only thing that kept him alive because he he said I should have died along with Shigaraki whenever that last blow was landed from from Deku and it's just it crazy that even in death the fact that New Order, Star, Deku, One for All, colluding did end up possibly almost killing him. And that was in like the smallest form of them actually working together. The tiniest form of them working together almost ended him. So it, it, for me, like thinking back, like it puts more weight on if she actually was the touchdown in Japan. It might have been over quick, quick, fast might have been over quick fast because like i is we've been thinking about what we've been thinking about what star what deku could do if he had new order and but i don't think we ever thought of because we know star struggled with we know star struggled with placing orders on herself and increasing her own limit you see how quickly she pulled up on Shiggy? Yeah. It's like, it's um like we know she had that issue. But there's no telling what she could have done with an order putting it on Deku. Like imagine if she would have placed some ridiculous order on Deku. And I and with the just, it feels like the limitless power that one for all has. It's in it's crazy. It's like this. It's like it feels like she could have done so many crazy uh, that combination. I think it was that might have been one of those things where it's like Hori came up with the idea of new order 
and was like, yeah, I'm going to introduce this and probably realized that he would write himself into a corner <laughs> if he allowed these two quirks to interact with each other. It's probably one of those things where it's like an editor or something or maybe him himself is like, we can't let that happen because just think. So you got to write it a certain way where it's just it's insane. Absolutely insane. The US heroes will come after the fight. We'll fight all for one or we'll fight Shiggy. It depends. Depends on how long it'll take them to get there because it took them. How long did it take them? An hour and a half, two hours to get to Japan. So they'll, I think they'll arrive right at the end of the battle, maybe or something like that. Two hours. It'll take. So if they're leaving right now, that's if it, if that's if that scene was in real time now. That's if that teen scene was in real time to what was happening in this chapter, because that scene damn sure could have been out of order and the U.S. heroes could be showing up. Um, Joe quickly should be. Yeah. Or you're making all for once. They soon to be corpses is foreshadowing. Yeah. A lot of the I that has, has to be something that's noted. Because so far for me and how I'm viewing all for one and in this series all for one almost always follows through on what he says. Almost always. I feel like there hasn't been but one time, and I'm trying to think of what it could have been, that when he said something that he didn't do it. Almost every, like he's almost got like a 100% connect rate when it comes to hoeing people. That's what I'm thinking. Like, he's, he's like, up there. He's up there. So, for him to be, like, and, and I don't think he's talking, like, it's, it depends because the body's taxed. This body is taxed. This body is taxed. So, I don't know. But, I, I don't, I will say. I'm not a fan of just killing characters just for the sake of killing characters. And I know we have the, the doomsday quirk um, theory and all that stuff. But there, I if the, no one dies in this skirmish, it'll seem a little crazy to me. It'll seem a little crazy to me. It would. It would. I don't know who Captain Celebrity is. It's from Vigilantes. I've yet to read Vigilantes. I don't even know who that is. That's that's the hero from the from Vigilantes. Um, it's cool to get some new hero designs towards the end. Yeah, maybe a way to show us um, designs he can use, possibly, possibly. Have, yeah, who, who is Captain Celebrity? If I Google Captain Celebrity, will I get a picture of him? I'm looking at a panel and he says, I'm the United States top drink hero, Captain Celebrity. Doesn't Vigilantes takes place years before before um the original before my hero, right? So, uh, okay, so I was I'm like, he was the number one hero in the US before Star. Someone on our side is going to die. It'll be after we bring Tenko's arc to a close. He's going to be a hero for the villain, so he'll have to become a martyr through death. I'm still um only like a couple of years, not a lot. I'm still curious as to where what the the last time we saw Shigaraki what that meant because I think we still view Shigaraki and Tenko as two different individuals but to me it felt like 
the last time we seen him yeah the last panel of him breaking where he was crumbling and like falling into the abyss but it felt when him and him and Deku were face to face it felt like Tenko accepted like I felt it felt like they be like they merged or whatever because it wasn't Shigaraki like the visual of Shigaraki didn't say that he wanted to be a hero for villains that was Tenko that said that and then it and it was like Tenko started it and then it f flipped over to Shiggy and then it was like the crumbling away and all of that stuff so I'm so it made me and then for all for one then to say that if if not for my own hatred I would have died with Shigaraki making it seem like Shigaraki died and the only reason why this body is still moving is because all for one in there is still alive that's how it made it sound it sounded like it sounded like Shiggy died but we can't man we thought star died and star was still in there somewhere So that's what that's so it's it may it's making me feel um yeah we know it's so it's like yeah i think the persona known as shigaraki died i don't know so i it, i but this that's why i'm still like puzzled on it because there's clear that there probably is something else to button in that to put the the bow on it clear that there's probably something else I just don't know, but it definitely made me feel like like he died, and that's what it. Whenever all for one said that, that threw that completely spun me on the situation, and I just put it off to the side. I really haven't thought about it. Where he's like, like we, and like because when I first initially thought of it, my first thought was like, so that means Deku killed him. Deku would have actively killed Shigaraki and followed through with what Gran Torino said. Yes, sometimes the only way you can save someone is by killing them. And Deku's intent might not have been like, I'm going to kill you, Shigaraki. Shigaraki. But it ended up being like Shigaraki is going to die from what from what Deku did from that fight. So I'm it. It's it's got like I'm just swirling. I, I need more. I need more. I need more. We're not getting a chap. Are we getting a chapter next week? I don't think we are. Right. No, we are getting a chapter next week. We are. I just need them. Keep them coming. All I know is I don't want to see. All I know is I don't want to see no time soon. Five chapters left. I don't want to see that five chapters because I think it'll be like that's the warning we get, right? It's not we don't get ten. Or do will we get a ten? You think we get a ten chapter warning or a five chapter warning? I would love for ten. Ten, but ten is just more anxiety. Five would feel like a blind side. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like we're. I as long as I don't see that ne anytime soon. Because if I see that, that'll make me throw up. Make me throw up a thousand percent. Think is there a chance all for one stole night eyes quirk? I think he has some he has to have some sort of foresight quirk. It might not be night eyes. He he's got a I, he has to have some sort of foresight quirk. Just he's too far ahead. And it's I think he's too far ahead in his thinking and it can't be smartness. I think he's smart, yes. Perceptive, yes. But the way that he sees ahead, it's just like it has to be a quirk. Has to be has to be some foresight quote then chapter heads up sounds more ideal okay i know i know tink is saying 100 more chapters <laughs> so you get to like volume 50 but there's plenty of times we don't get to end on a nice even number or whatever but it's volume 50 right man this chapter made me emotional sorry it choked me up and plus i love deku's mom too like one seeing roadie Rody's my guy. I love I love movie three. Rody's my guy. So seeing Rody and Melissa show up, and seeing um his little, his um siblings, 
like seeing them dope but the thing is is we've put so much emphasis on everyone is at the end of their rope everyone is even all for one now this is when i said this is a, they've been fighting they've been scrapping that's one like usually a, a like for all it's like everyone involved everyone involved um this chapter marks the end of 41 gotcha everyone involved is at the end of their road the the, the final villain seemingly the final villain is beaten battered destroyed almost the main hero is beaten battered and almost destroyed the whole supporting cast is beaten battered and almost destroyed and dying Every, this feels like if this is the fight the end all fight <laughs> where everyone is just at the end of their line where it's just like where are we pulling it from i don't know but we still gotta keep going it's not like it doesn't feel like all for one is lording over them and he's still perfectly fine and we have to like weird plot arm our way through it's like no last chapter all for one standing there like dude i don't know how much bo uh, how this body is at the end of its line and i don't know how much more i can get out of it but i need to i i, I need to end this now you say two plus volumes left so 20 and 30 chapters you gonna make me sick <sighs> does if this feels like the end man basically spitting in the gas tank <laughs> yeah. mm -hmm. i i just but i like the feeling of it though i do i like the feeling of it where it's like dude the ember is 1000 percent. we're pulling on everything we possibly can we're pulling on everything we're pulling on everything 